Hello and welcome. Today's presentation is brought to you by Science Visualized. And we're going to be looking at a math question where we're using long division method to solve this problem where 642 is divided by 7. And what's the answer? So in this case, the 642 is called the dividend. While the number that you're dividing it with, 7, is the divisor. And the answer to the problem is called a quotient. So now, now the question is, what is 642 divided by 7 equals to? And in order to solve this problem, we take the dividend and put it here, 642 divided by 7. Now we look for the lowest product of 7 that's close to the first digit there. The first digit there is 6, but because 6 is below 7, then we cannot use 6. We have to use the two digits, and that's 64. And when you look at 64, you will see that 7 times 9 gives you 63, and then we'll write 63 below 64. And then we'll go ahead and subtract. 6 minus 6 is 0. 4 minus 3 is 1. Now we're left with 1, but since 1 is less than 7, then we drop down or bring that number 2 down and put it here, and now that becomes 12. And since 12 is more than 7, we see that 7 can go into 12 one time, so we write 1 there, and then 7 times 1 is 7, and then we go ahead and subtract 7 from 12, and we remain with 5. Now since 5 is lower than 7, 7 cannot divide 5, so we just say that the remainder is 5, and therefore the answer equals to, you use this number, 91 and 5 over 7. So you put the remainder over 7, and that's going to be the quotient or the answer. So therefore, 642 divided by 7, which also equals to 642 over 7, the answer for that is 91 and 5 over 7. Thank you very much for your time.